Alrighty, vocab for 4-4, graphing a function rule. Alrighty, so a continuous function uh, is a function whose graph is unbroken. Right here, graph is unbroken. Notice here, so graph, it's the, most of the stuff you, you do. When you graph a straight line and connect it, it's a continuous function, it's unbroken. The opposite of that will be discrete, and that will be the next word. So a discrete function is a function whose graph is a set of distinct isolated points. A discrete graph is composed of distinct, again, isolated points, so dots. This is when it doesn't make sense to have um, portions of something. Like, like if you're talking about money, you can have, you know, $5.2, right? $5.20. But if you're talking about people, like uh, the number of people that uh, did something, I don't know, whatever the graph happens to be, um, you can't have parts of a people because that's parts of a person, or <laughs> parts of a people. Anyway, you can't have parts of a person because that's gross. So, you know, you'd say people have 2.4 children. That's weird. Um, so that's when it makes more sense. And you'll see the examples we do uh, where it makes sense to, you only sell like, I think the one example of all is you only sell whole cheese wheels, not portions of them. So it makes sense only to have individual distinct points in that case. Discrete versus continuous.